You see, what I'm going to do here, I'm going to blame the Ravens for this one. Reason I'm blaming the Baltimore Ravens for this one is because they haven't given us anything to get upset or frustrated with for a very long time now. So th that's going to be my reasoning as to why people are trying to get upset over Lamar Jackson not being at voluntary school workouts so for so so on and so forth anyway so today there's been a lot of uproar within the baltimore ravens community um because there are people that are frustrated upset disappointed whatever the case may be mad at lamar jackson again you, you know i mean there's always a long list of reasons why people are mad at lamar jackson simply because he's lamar jackson they all people are always gonna look for something they always gonna look for something to be mad at Lamar Jackson for. But anyway, today, there have been people who have been upset at the fact that... And, and this even happened like last week, too, with the whole the, 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 the school, the Ravens school and whatnot. Upset that Lamar Jackson is not there physically, in person, at the Baltimore Ravens facility. And with that, it's, I think a big word... And I, he just signed a new contract. I get that. Hey, this with great power comes great responsibility. Lamar Jackson is Spider-Man. But anyway, um, with him not being there, it is okay. It's really okay. Number one, it's voluntary. So you don't have to be there. It's not a requirement that you're there. It's not a necessity that you're there. Another thing. Lamar Jackson was not the only veteran Raven who wasn't there. Wow, it feels kind of feels kind of weird. Lamar Jackson's so young, but calling him a veteran that, that feels kind of weird. But he is a veteran because he's been in the NFL longer than four years, so he is a, a veteran. But anyway, um, he was not the only person that was not in attendance there. But anyway, uh, another thing too, uh, people were. Sort of discrediting Lamar Jackson, saying, what's he really doing? Is he even really putting in any work? Is he getting anything done? You can't do anything by yourself. You need to be at the facility, Lamar. You need to be with your teammates, Lamar. Now, I get the concern if you're thinking like, hey, new offense, this thing is getting installed. Hey, Lamar, you being there with your teammates would be better. But, see, that's, that's again, this is why we just got to wait, man, because he's in South Florida, with one of his new teammates, that being Nelson Aguilar. Look at look at Nelson coming through there. Nelson was like, look, a lot of y'all forgot about me when the whole Odell Beckham Jr. thing happened. A lot of y'all forgot about me when the Ravens drafted Zay Flowers. A lot of y'all forgot about me. But let, 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 me, let me put these Ravens fans on and let me get them some excitement, some happiness, something to smile about. Because I know they be needing it. And hopefully he'll give the Ravens fans plenty of stuff to smile about during the season when he makes all these amazing catches and scores all these touchdowns and gets all this yak. It's going to be great. But anyway, Nelson Aguilar posted himself with who other than Lamar Jackson. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that something? So there were a lot of people saying Lamar wasn't putting in no work since he's not there at the facility, at the Ravens actual facility. They say Lamar not putting in no work. He ain't doing nothing. He ain't getting nothing accomplished since he's down in South Florida. Why he not with his teammate? Well, he actually is. And he's building chemistry with who? Oh, his teammates. And another thing, too. Again, it's voluntary. But another thing, too. I just don't get why people get so worked up. Because it's May, it's May 18th. It's May 18th. Season don't start till September. Unless some people forgot. I think people think the season starts tomorrow, so maybe the next week or maybe even the next month. No, 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 no. The season does not start for another June, July, August, September, four months. We got a long time, y'all. Even though it's going to go by fast. Trust me, it's going to go by fast. I know some of y'all thinking like, man, we got the long off season. Man, it's going to go by so slow. I miss my Ravens football. I miss NFL in general. You're going to see it real, real soon. Trust me. That four months is going to fly. I guarantee it. I promise you, it really will. It always does, especially these past couple of off seasons. But anyway, 
the season ain't starting tomorrow. It's really not. So I just, I, I don't understand all the frustration with this. Because again, he's working, getting acclimated with one of his new teammates. With one of his new teammates. He even talked about in his presser after the contract, he said he's getting ready to work with Zay too, with Zay Flowers. He said they both going to link up in South Florida and work together too. Hey, maybe they already have, who knows? But they're going to put in work too. And then now, if, if this was mandatory, if it was mandatory workouts, mandatory OTAs, mandatory practice, mandatory whatever, if it was mandatory, mandatory means you have to do it. It means it's a requirement. If it was mandatory, then I'd be like, okay, I get it. I get the frustration. I get the outrage. I get, I, I get it all. I get why people are upset because it's mandatory. But guess what? Guess what? Guess, 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 guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? It's not. It's not. So the fact that it's not mandatory, it's voluntary. The fact that he is working with at least one of his teammates, who knows if it's more? Because Nelson Aguilar, it could be other people there. Because we've seen it a lot of times when there will be one person that posts. So we all going crazy. Oh, okay, he's there. Oh, what about the other guys? Sometimes, sometimes there's not other guys there. Sometimes it's just them and somebody else. But other times, there may be people who are there that are, they're not on social media. Or they just didn't post. They like, oh, I don't feel like posting today. I don't feel like uploading no story today. No, I'm just here and I'm working. Let's get this work in. Go have some fun later, whatever. And they ain't worried about the social media stuff. But again, I told you, I'm blaming the Ravens on this one because Ravens been giving us so much to be happy about, so much to cheer about that I think for some fans, it's just been weird. It's like, man, we got to be mad over something today. So what's it going to be? Ah, oh, Lamar. You not an M&T bank? Well, you not an Owens Mills, buddy? Well, you, you get your butt up to Owens Mills, buddy. Get up there, buddy. You need to go up there, buddy. So it's always something. But And another thing, too. Lamar Jackson is officially a Baltimore Raven. He is signed. That contract is signed, sealed, and delivered. So the playbook. How could he learn the playbook? How could he get acclimated with the playbook? Well, you ever heard of an iPad? You ever heard of a file? You ever heard of an email? You ever heard of Google Share? You ever heard of a Google Drive? You ever heard any of that stuff where you can share large files? I'm sure, I'm sure that the Ravens have a way to give Lamar Jackson the playbook. Even though he's not there in person. Even though he's not with the Ravens in person right now. Even though he's not up there in all emails right now. I'm sure they have a way and have found a way to give him the playbook. And it, worst case scenario, if he doesn't even got the playbook yet, it is May 18th. It's May 18th. So, you, you hear Carter out there laughing? Carter is la right now laughing at people who are upset over this. But, hey, it's all good. It's just another day. Another day in Ravens flock. But anyway, Lamar Jackson will be fine. Nelson Aguilar will be fine. Todd Munkin will be fine. John Harbaugh, everybody will be fine. Again, if this was mandatory, hey, all the outrage you want. If it's mandatory, hey, Lamar just signed a big contract. He not there for mandatory this, mandatory that, but all the work. Okay, then I, then I get, but we ain't even close to that yet. So let's all breathe. I love y'all. Hey, and whether you're mad at Lamar Jackson or not, I still love you. I still love you. So... It is, and it's, this stuff happens. It's okay. It's okay. It'll be all right. Ravens, Lamar, and everybody, we're going to get through this thing together. I love y'all. I love you watching this. I love you. Hey, make sure y'all subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. So, again, once things start going crazy again, because, you know, Ravens, Ravens, like, they, 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 they sneaky with it. They'll be quiet, quiet, quiet. Then, boom, out of nowhere. They start, y'all know how it goes. And they drop bombshell after bombshell after bombshell after bombshell after bombshell. You know how they do. But anyway, I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. And we out.